The True Project presents. Hi there, my name is Fiona Meisel. I'm a disabled artist and advocate, and I'm excited to share with you today how to draw the invisible. I draw the invisible in order to visualize the hidden world of emotions that self-reflection causes one to see. To do this, I will often use images, letters, photos, or anything that causes me to look back on a specific situation. You can use a variety of art supplies. This can include, but is not limited to, wax crayons, colored pencils, markers, or oil pastels. The most important part of this exercise is the process of reflection and self-awareness. I invite you to grab your tools, turn on your favorite music, and just draw. Initially, I find it important to lay down a base. This is done by accentuating the photo and the page with colorful markings. This allows for a foundation of large shapes and patterns to help form and inspire the marks and details to come. The next step is to overlap more layers of texture, color, and material to add depth and meaning to your work. Be sure to value the repetitions and patterns you might see in your work. These patterns might be expressing a certain emotion you are feeling during this moment of your life, which is important to remember and reflect on. This whole process is quite flexible. Personally, I like to incorporate color into these works where I find it allows mood variation. This is a personal preference and doesn't work for everyone, but it is important to reflect on what you're doing, how you are feeling at a specific time, and how you can use mark making and colors and patterns to reflect that. As this project is coming to an end, I hope you were able to take some time to reflect on both the process and how this plays into everyday life. When people take time to visualize what is mentally going on, they are able to then reflect on one's growth over a period of time. Especially through times like this of uncertainty, reflection and self-awareness are extremely relevant and should not go overlooked. This is an uncomplicated project that can be completed in a short period of time, which allows for anyone to visualize and reflect on one's inner self. When looking at your final work, take into consideration that this should not be a masterpiece. It is a project focusing on reflection, not perfection. We as artists are quite privileged to be able to express ourselves in a visual medium. I hope that by taking time to just create and not focus on creating the next masterpiece, the process of art making and the label of artist becomes more accessible.